My name is John Lawson. Welcome to Hydro Harvest Farms. As you pull up to Hydro Harvest Farms in Ruskin, Florida, you're greeted with a sign welcoming you to the farm of the future. And indeed, John Lawson's farm isn't just any farm. It's one that grows produce using minerals, nutrients, and water, but no soil. During my visit, John showed me just how the hydroponic process works. We mix the nutrients up in, in barrels uh, here behind the shed and then uh, inject them into the water supply as we feed. The nutrient comes through this line, through this line, and deposits into the top pot. We put about a quart three times a day, and then it works its way down and it feeds all the plants in the tower. Somewhat surprisingly, John claims that a major benefit of hydroponic farming is the amount of water used. So this tower has approximately 24 plants in it and we'll use less than a gallon of water a day to feed and water 24 plants. We figure it's about an 80% savings in water. Another impressive thing about hydro harvest farms is just how much they are able to grow on a single small acre. We figure that um, we have about six times the amount of plants uh, than a, as a traditional farm. This high rate of productivity is in part because John is growing not only horizontally on the land, but vertically as well. In addition, John is determined to use every last inch of space his one acre has to offer. Down below, we don't want to waste any space or any nutrients, so we grow our uh, onions or our potatoes or any root crop or things that vine. However, even John will admit that there are some drawbacks to the hydroponic system. The drawbacks to growing this way is uh, the initial costs because it's, it's expensive to get into it. And then uh, it's a little bit more labor intensive. At the end of the crop, we can't just jump up in a tractor and turn the, the uh, crop under. We actually have to disassemble the, the, the uh, towers and sift it out and then and then reset it. So those are the two disadvantages uh, to doing it this way. Nonetheless, between saving money on water and overall higher productivity and some gorgeous produce, John seems to think that hydroponic farming is the right style of farming for him. Be sure to check out Hydro Harvest Farms at hydroharvestfarms.com and learn more about Bon Appetit's Farm to Fork program at www.bamco.com.